Adding and subtracting decimals. Adding decimals is easy when you keep your work neat. To add decimals, follow these steps. Write down the numbers with the decimal points lined up. Put in zeros so the numbers have the same length. Then add, using column addition. Example, add 1.452 to 1.3. Line up the decimal points. Pad with zeros. Then add. The answer is 2.752. Example, add 3.25, 0 0.075 and 5. Line up the decimal points. Pad with zeros. Then add. The answer is 8.325. That's all there is to it. Just remember to line up the decimal points. Pad with zeros, then add normally. Subtracting. To subtract, follow the same method. Line up the decimal points, then subtract. Example, what is 7.368 minus 1.15? Line up the decimal points. Pad with zeros. Then subtract. The answer is 6.218. To check we can add the answer to the number subtracted. To check, let us try adding 6.218 to 1.15. Line up the decimal points. Pad with zeros. Then add. It matches the number we started with, so it checks out. Why can we put in extra zeros? The zero says there is no value at this decimal place. In a number like 10, the 0 is saying no ones. In a number like 2.50 the 0 is saying no hundredths. So it is safe to take a number like 2.5 and make it 2.50 or 2.500 etc. But don't take 2.5 and make it 20.5, that is plain wrong.